Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you a few trades that were posted on Friday, 13th of October 2023. This trade was traded by KZ, who's trading S&P 500 CFD. As you see, the macro chart is in downtrend, and we see the downtrend channel here. And this wave of the downtrend was seen in the structural 5-minute chart, and we can see also the downtrend channel here. So again, this wave of the downtrend channel was seen in the 1-minute trading chart. And based on algo 1 to 5, we identified this area of sell short entry and entered two positions and managed and closed them with profit. So thank you, KZ, for sharing your trades with us. The next trade was shared by Yasin, who's trading also S&P 500 CFD. As you see, again, the macro chart is in downtrend, and we see the downtrend channel. And you can see also downtrend channel in the structural 5-minute chart. So using 1-minute trading chart, we identified this area of pullback and entered based on algo 1 to 5 two sell short entries and set up the stop and targets and manage and close them with exit strategy number 2 with profit. So thank you Yasin for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades were shared by Yan, our global instructor who's trading gold USD. As you see the macro chart is in a strong uptrend and this channel of uptrend in the structural chart was identified as a low risk area. So he entered several long positions here based on algo 1 to 5 and entered and managed these three positions with exit strategy number 1 with profit. So thank you Yan for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades are those that I have taken during the New York market session and the video with detailed explanation was sent to students yesterday. So I'm going to replay the video here for you. Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you a few trades that I have taken today on Friday 13th of October 2023. These trades were taken on NASDAQ, Dow Jones, and S&P 500. If we look at the one hour micro chart, we see that the price was fluctuating between the previous day close and also low on all e -minis. And during the London session, it started to go up. And if you look at the New York market session, we see that after opening, the price went up and couldn't hold it. And it started to go down after the news and kept going and passed the previous day close. So around 11.30 when S&P 500 was testing the previous day close and point of control, I took one long positions. And because it was downtrend and I take long positions usually, I waited for the price to settle and close to the end of market when this area was retested one more time and got rejected on Nasdaq and Dow Jones. I took several long positions with setup B and C, and these trades were copied by copy trader to multiple Apex Trader funds accounts with different ratios, and the result was positive. So I'm going to show you the result of this one. And as you see, the profit factor on today's, which was choppy, was about 1.27 with 63% win rate and average win to loss ratio of 0.73. The largest winning trade was 210 and the largest losing trade was $189. So hope this trade taken by the PATH system is useful for you and let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day and also weekend.